Joe Burrow, when he met with the media earlier this week, uh, reiterated uh, he's ready to go. It's just a lot of hard work to try to get healthy, try to get back. So I'm in a good spot. You feel like you guys are ready to go for a week one? Yeah, I'm ready to go. I think, I mean, we're going to see how these next couple days play out because you never know with these things. But uh, I'm expecting to play. Uh, like I said, we'll see how these next couple days go. Can you walk us through kind of what, because we haven't talked to you since it happened. Can you walk us through what happened on that flight with you got there? Yeah, just muscle strain. Um, so it just takes a while to get back from those. They're finicky and got to spend a lot more time healing than you anticipate. Uh, and so we're, we're in that process right now. Did you think it was worse than it was originally when you first got on that cart? No, I knew. I knew what it was. Uh, I know what, know what an Achilles feels like. I knew it wasn't that. Uh, so I was obviously disappointed, but... Uh, knew what it was. And with that, let's welcome in Marissa Contapelli, a longtime friend of the show, as long as the team reporter for the Bengals, uh, Bengals.com. Um, Marissa, Joe Burrow pretty much knew that he wasn't going to miss significant time. You, you can just kind of gather that. Did, did you gather that as well in, in hearing him talk to media? I did. And even though towards the end of his press conference, when it kind of got circled back to his availability for Sunday, he he went back and was like, well, you know, we're going to take it day to day. I, I would be shocked if Burrow was not on that field on Sunday week one against a divisional opponent. Uh, this guy's a competitor. Uh, so we're hoping he's going to be and he is at 100 percent. But it looks like things have been trending in the right direction from Burrow. And I understand them not wanting to rush things back with him to get him back on the field because uh, it's the last thing you would want to do. But from what he had said on Wednesday and just everything we've seen out from him at practice, uh, it looks like he has some pretty good mobility when it comes to his calf. And they were he was running before they reintegrated him. So it isn't like they went from, well, you're you're rehabbing to here you're back in he was you know he took the proper progression that you'd want to see 